Okay, so we had this idea since people are in quarantine, we could show them magic over FaceTime and give them a little bit of entertainment. And then that also we could make a video out of it for you guys. So we asked a lot of people and our response was huge. So thank you to all the people who agreed to be in this video. Uh, there are so many, in fact, that we decided to make this a three part series. So uh, here's the first video of the series. I'll have the links to all the people inside the videos, Instagrams down below, so go check them out. And also we had a lot of issues making this video with sound quality. So thank you to the people who are patient with us. And there's a couple of clips that the sound didn't work on it for some reason. So uh, there's gonna be music in the background and hopefully the tricks are self-explanatory enough you can see what's happening. Um, thank you guys for taking the time to watch this. Like, comment, uh, let us know what you think. Subscribe if you haven't and enjoy the video. Oh. Say stop wherever you want. Stop. All right. So this will be your card. Remember it, I won't look. Okay. All right, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get it lost in the deck somewhere. So somewhere in here. <coughs> I'm gonna shuffle two. All right, so now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go through the cards like this. Say stop as many times as you want, and whenever you say stop, <coughs> I'll flip that many over. Okay. Stop. 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 There we go. Okay. Uh... Stop. All right, so all the cards are kind of in a mess now. There's face up cards, face down cards, they're kind of all over, right? Yep. But you picked a card before it, right? At the beginning? Yeah. So if I snap my fingers, all the cards will go back in the right order. What? Except for one card. Oh. What was your card? The five of diamonds. The five of diamonds? It's actually the six of diamonds. Actually the six? Nah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty good. Thank you. That, that was pretty good. Two of our bands. They're different colors, so you can tell them apart, right? So there's a yep. weird thing with our bands. You can actually take one, and if you hook it over the other, they'll link together. I don't know if you can see that. And then if you shake them, then they unlink. That's so weird. <laughs> Easy trick. It's a rubber band trick. So there's a yellow one and a red one. They're different colors, so you can tell them apart. Okay. There's a weird thing, though, with rubber bands. You can take one, and if I hook it over... They'll actually link together. I don't know if you can see that. And if I shake it, then they'll unlink. It'll go back to normal. No. <laughs> Top one. Oh, took two of me there. The Jack of Hearts. So I'll show you why the Jack of Hearts is magical. That it has a little more magic than the other. We're going to put a bend in it so we can follow it. So if I move it over here, you can see it based on the bend, right? Yep. All right. So... Imagine the jack rising all the way to the top. Just going all the way through the cards and jumping to the top. Whoa. And looking all the way to the top. Okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> So, there are different colors you can tell them apart. There's a red one and a yellow one. Yeah. There's a weird thing with our bands, though. So, if you take one, you can hook it over the other, and they'll link together. I don't know if you can see that. And if I shake them, then they'll unlink. So, they go back to normal. <laughs> <laughs> so, first, we're going to pick a card, and then we'll get to it later. We won't look at it, but it'll come into play later. So, for, say, uh, stop wherever you want. Right there? 
Okay, what we're going to do, we're going to put it here. I'm going to put this one sideways. We'll get to that in a minute. So now I have a pen and sticky notes. So first, I'm going to make a prediction, and then I'm going to ask you a question. So first, I'll make my prediction. All right, we'll get to this in a second. So name any single digit number you want. Seven. Seven. Okay, so a lot of people pick seven, so to make sure I couldn't just randomly guess that, name any three-digit number. 342. All right, so next I'm going to ask you another question, but first I'm going to make another prediction. Hopefully I got the spelling right on this one. All right, so give the name of someone that you know that I would not know. Just the first name. What is her I can't even remember her name. Um, Brianna. Okay, so next I'm going to try to predict the card that you cut to. All right, so we've written three different predictions, right, on sticky notes? And I asked you a couple questions yeah. first. So for the first question I asked you, what, do you remember what it was? Uh, name a single-digit number, right? And you said seven, but you changed yeah. it to 342. So I crossed yeah. out the seven. And then I asked you to name someone that I would not know. And you said Brianna. Uh-huh. And then lastly, I predicted the card. So, we'll see what card you cut to first. You cut to the Nine of Hearts. And the card that I wrote down was the Nine of Hearts. Um, okay, I have... <laughs> that's not okay for the... No. What's wrong with it? Just being psychic. <laughs> I guess. Okay, Cam. And being able to mind read. <laughs> that creeps me out. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Yep, yep. Name any card that you see. Um, I see Ace of Hearts. Ace of Hearts. All right, let's see where that one goes. Right here. All right. Yeah. So, you said the Ace of Hearts. And what we'll do, we're going to put this one right here for now. Okay. So, you could have picked any of these. And they're all different, right? Yeah. But they all have one thing in common, which is the backs. They're all blue. All blue. Except for the card you picked. You managed to pick the only card with a red back. Okay. <laughs> all right, we're going to try another one. With, uh, so I have a deck of cards here, and we're going to try a mind-reading thing with these and a couple other stuff. So first, say stop wherever you want. Stop. Right there? Okay, we'll cut the deck. Yeah right there and we'll leave this sideways for now so i have a pen and some sticky notes so first i'm going to make a prediction and then i'm going to ask you a question okay okay so first i'm going to try to predict what you're going to say all right so i'm going to fold this up and we'll get to this and then we'll put that right there Name any single digit number you want. Mm, seven. Seven. Okay, so just to make sure I couldn't just get lucky and guess you say seven, make it harder. Name any three digit number. Three. Oh, I have uh, 219. 219. Okay, so I'm going to make another prediction and then I'm going to ask you another question. Oh, yeah. All right. Say the name of someone that you know that I would not know. Uh, Just the first name. Geez. Kira. All right. So next, I'm going to try to predict the card that you should stop at. Okay. All right. So we have three sticky notes, right? That I've written on. Mm -hmm. 
So we'll go through them in the same order. So first, I made a prediction, and then I asked you to pick a number, right? Yes. And you said seven, but I crossed it out because you changed it to 219. What? Oh, my gosh. And then I had you name someone that I didn't know. Let's see if I got the spelling right. And you said Kira. Oh, my gosh. And then I you cut to a card at the beginning. So you cut to... Well, first we'll look at the prediction. So I wrote that you would cut to the Jack of Spades. And the card you cut to is the Jack of Spades. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. <laughs> this one, you're going to do everything for it. So first, name a number 1 through 13. Um, 5. Actually, five. 8. 8? Eight. Eight? Alright, I'm going to yeah. take out all the 8s. see all right so we have the four eights name a red one and a black one of the eights or just like in general of the eights um a okay eight of diamonds and eight of spades all right so what i'm going to do with these we're going to put them in the middle of the deck we'll get to those in a second all right so without looking at this top card do you think it's a red card or a black card? Um, black card. It's a red card. So yeah. all you're going to do is going to guess. If you think it's red, yeah. so I'll hold a card. If you think it's red, say red. I'll put it here. If you say black, I'll put it here. Okay. Uh, red. Black. Red. Black. 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 Red. Red. Black. Red, black, red, uh, red, black, black, red, black, red, 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 black, red, red. All right, so we got halfway through. So to make sure I'm not cheating, we're going to switch it up. So now I'm going to put the black cards on this side and the red cards on this side. All right. So do you think this okay. is red or black? Um, Red. Black. Black. Red. 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 Black. Black, red, black, black, red, black, 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 red, black, red, red, black, red, red, and black, and red. All right, I didn't do anything, right? That was all you? Yeah. Do you feel like I made you lay them down in any specific way? No. <laughs> no free I was just saying things. <laughs> all right, so you started with red cards here. We'll see how many you got right. Okay. All those ones? And then you did black cards here. No. No. What? And then you did the same over here, but in reverse order. Yeah. So you started with the black cards. Okay. And then at the eight, you switch to the red cards? Yep. <laughs> that that doesn't make sense. <laughs> you did everything. I didn't do it. You, you told me where to leave That's them. why it doesn't make sense. <laughs> what? <laughs> that was really good, Ken. That one, Thank you. that's probably, that's the best one I've seen from you so far. That was really good. So the next trick I'm going to try, it's a little different. It's going to be more of a mind reading trick. So first we're going to have you pick a card. We're not going to look at it, but we'll get to it in a second. So say stop okay. wherever you want. Okay. Stop. Right there. Okay, so yeah. what we're going to do, we're going to put this here for now, and we'll put the rest sideways. We'll get to that in a second. Okay. So now I have a pen and a pad of sticky notes. So yeah. what I'm going to do is first I'm going to make a prediction, and then I'm going to ask you a question. Okay. All right, so first I'm going to try to predict what I think you're going to say. Oop. 
All right. So, name any single digit number you want. Any single digit? Yes. Like, oh, um, eight. Eight? Okay, so just to make sure I couldn't just, like, randomly guess that, make it harder for me. Name a three-digit number. Three-digit? Yeah. Um, 125. Okay, so I'm going to ask you another question, but first I'm going to make another prediction. Okay. I know. <laughs> All right. So, n give the name, just the first name, of someone that you know that I would not know. <laughs> Bro. So, sorry, say that again? Ro. R-O. Okay. So, next, I'm going to try to predict the card that you picked over here. Okay. All right. So, we made three different predictions. We have them on sticky notes. So, but first, though, we'll go back through everything. So, first, I made a prediction, and I asked you a question. I asked you for a single-digit number, but then you changed it to a three-digit number. So, I wrote... Eight, but then I crossed it out because you changed it to 125. Yes. And then I asked you for the name of someone that I didn't know, and you said uh -huh. Roe. Yes. And then I predicted the. Okay. And then the prediction that I made is a Jack of Spades. Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Say stop wherever you want. Uh, stop. All right, right there. All right, so yeah. I'll take this card, memorize it. I won't look. Okay. All right, so now what we're going to do, I'm going to take your card, and I'm going to slide it into the deck. Okay. All right, what if I could wave my hand over the deck and your card flips over? Or, That'd be pretty wacky. <laughs> what if I can make an entire suit flip over? Oh. Or what if I can make the entire deck flip over? So all the cards flip back over, except for one what? card. What was your card? Uh, six of hearts. Six of hearts. Ooh. <laughs> that was crazy. All right.
So say, I'm going to go through like this. Say stop wherever you want. Stop. All right. So this will be your card. I'll look away. You got okay. it? All right. We're going to put it face down on top. And I'm going to cut the deck. All right. This is going to sound a little weird. Blow a kiss to the deck. <laughs> like this? Yeah. Okay. And what happens is your card will change. Watch. It'll blush. You'll see it. One card changes color in the deck. Oh, oh my gosh. What was your card? Uh, I think it was the nine of diamonds. The ten of diamonds? Ten. Thank you. Ten. Exactly. <laughs> All right. So we're going to try to take it a step further. So we're going to do we're gonna take the ten. I'm going to put it right here. Say stop wherever you want. Stop. Right there. Okay. Memorize the card. I'll look away. Okay. All right. Again, blow a kiss to the deck. And your card changes again, right? But the red card's been here on the table the entire time. What was your card? Uh, the seven of clubs. The seven of clubs? Oh my god. <laughs> that makes no sense. It's not supposed to make sense. But I don't, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so... I have a Sharpie here. Okay. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the Ace of Spades. And on the back of it, I'm going to write a prediction of what I think you're going to end up picking. All right. So we'll leave that there for now. So all the other cards, just name one out loud that you see. Uh, Ten of Spades. Ten of Spades. All right, so... How I said I was going to make a prediction before, right? And I wrote yes. on the back of the ace what my prediction mm -hmm. was going to be. I actually wrote that you would have picked the ten of spades. It's kind of backwards. But... But... Yeah. And then here's the really but... cool thing about it, too, is I can take the ace and then with it, I can actually pull on it and it'll change into the ten. And when it changes into the ten, it keeps the writing on it also. No. <laughs> what? So I'm going to go through the cards like this. Say stop wherever you want. Okay. Stop. Right there. All right. This yeah. will be your card. I'll show it to you. I'll look away. Remember it. Wait. Put it closer. Okay. All right. So I'm going to put it face down on top of the deck. And then we're going to cut the cards once. All right. This is going to sound kind of weird. But blow a kiss to the deck. Okay. There you go. And what happens is your card will blush. Watch. One card changes. What was your card? It was the nine of spades. The nine of yes. spades? Yes. Nine or six. Six is nine. The nine of spades? Yeah. <laughs> All right. We're going to try to take it a step further. So we're going to take it. We're going to put that there. We'll get to it again in a second. So now say stop wherever you want. Stop. Right there. Okay. Remember the card. I'll look away. Okay. All right. Again, blow a kiss to the deck. And your card changes it again, right? Okay. <laughs> but we've had the red card here the entire time. What was your card? <laughs> Ten hearts. The Ten of Hearts? Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> what? I don't, do it now. <laughs> now. I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to go through the cards like this. Say stop wherever you want. Right. Stop. Right there? Okay, this will be your card. I'll look away. Remember it? Okay. Oh, crap, All right, we're going to put think... it. You want to see it again? I know. Okay, yeah, I know what it is. I, I, yeah, I know what it is. Okay, I'm going to put it face down on top, and then we're going to cut the deck. All right, this is going to sound kind of weird. Blow a kiss to the deck. And what happens is your card will blush. Watch. You'll see it. It'll blush? Yeah, see, one card changes red out of the whole deck. Oh. What was your card? Okay, I don't... I get confused with the spades and the clubs. I think it was the clubs, though. Eight, eight of clubs. Eight of clubs? What the heck? No. We're going to try to take it a step further. So I'm going to put this right here. We'll get to it again 
in a second. Say stop wherever you want. Stop. Right there? Okay, remember the card? I'll look away. Okay. All right. Again, blow a kiss to the deck. And it changes it again, right? Yeah. Don't tell me. Uh-uh. But we've had the red card here on the table the entire time. What was your card? The one that I just looked at? Yeah. Ten of hearts. Ten of hearts? Okay, <laughs> I want to look through that stack again to see if there's still a ten of hearts in there. What the heck? <laughs> Ian! So too what much free time heck? does. <laughs> that is so crazy. 